We love to give you ideas of things to do and places to go. And, of course, that means what's going on in our area and particularly with World Book Day not too far away. And maybe your little ones are getting involved in one way or another. If they are, it is a wonderful day. It's a great way. We've got Julian Clary coming up on the show very soon to talk about that. Of course, uh, quite a prolific author these days as well as an entertainer. And Chelmsford children's author and illustrator Emma R. McNally, who's one of the first in Britain, if not the first, to be offered offering a virtual author visit so that every school child across the world can hear her first reading of a new book on the same day. She's on the line to me now. Good afternoon, Emma. Hello, how are you? I am very well. What a fantastic idea. What made you come up with this in the first place? Uh, well, I'm all about helping children to develop a love of reading of books because I really do think that if you can have that love of reading, that lasts your lifetime and really helps out open up opportunities for children's future. And I really thought that, actually, it shouldn't be about how much budget a school has. It should be an open opportunity to every single child across the whole of the world to be involved with my new book. So that's where the idea came from. And tell me about your latest book. What's it about? Yes. OK, so my latest book is called The Cloudosaurus Rex. Um, it's a rhyming action book for children aged three to six. Um, and it's it's really good fun. It's brilliant for children to get involved with the, the rhyming verse, um, to learn the actions, but it's also got messages in there about other people's feelings. You learn the days of the week, and it's about the weather, and also, obviously, about dinosaurs. <laughs> yeah, and that's really... Because uh, kids love dinosaurs, don't they? Especially at that age. Absolutely, absolutely. It's one of the favourites. So, yes, so very excited. And I'm, I'm actually at Tudor Court Primary School right now in Grays. Um, I'm standing just outside their, their building, just about to go in with 240 children are sitting waiting um, to record the um, the session, which is going to be available on YouTube on World Book Day. So for free for, for children to join in. Lovely. So on World Book Day, we'll be able to log into YouTube. And what will we have to type in on that day? Okay. So pop in Emma R. McNally, virtual author visit, um, and there you'll find the tra there's a trailer there already. So if you want to do it in advance, you can. Um, or you can go onto my website, which is all the W's, and then haroldhuxley.co.uk. Um, and on my website, we've got like activity sheets and love to reading stuff. Um, we've got some um, colouring things to do. We've got word searches for children to do. So there's lots of other um, activities for them to join in with as well. Um, it will be live just before World Book Day and I'm going to keep it up for probably a couple of days afterwards. So if, you know, because um, it's always busy, isn't it, on World Book Day? <laughs> yeah, everybody's on. doing stuff, yeah. Exactly. So <laughs> if um, other schools want to get involved or children at home want to get involved, but they know that they're a bit busy on that Thursday, so it'll be there for Friday and the weekend so they can join in then as well. How wonderful. Well, I wish you all the very best with it. It sounds absolutely you terrific. Much. And you must come on the show at some stage and we'll have a good old natter, bring a few of the books in. That would be fantastic. I would Lovely. love to. I well, would love to. Emma, Thank enjoy. So and I must admit, having 250 children around you, they're a good audience for your book, aren't they? Let's be perfect. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and you know what? They're the, honest, the most honest people. So, yep. And you always know you've written a good book when as soon as you finish, they go, again, again. And that's how I can, how, how I can tell whether I've got a good book. So, yeah, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> a pleasure, Emma. Thank you so much for your time. Emma R. McNally there, the Chelmsford Children's author, who is recording that for World Book Day right now. She's in Grey's at this moment with 250 children, and you'll be able to look out for her on YouTube on World Book Day. No doubt we'll get her in on the show as well, talking more about that. Something a little